Oh, it's time for another math. Easy solution. Trying to discuss pretty amazing feature with Google Maps, and it's this 3D icon that shows up whenever you go any directions, and it basically gives a visual tour of uh, what, wherever you're going, and it's pretty amazing. But before I get to it, I just want to talk about this route. So this route is around 124K. It's from Georgia and Burrard in downtown Vancouver, where I live, and basically it's all the way to Blackholm Whistler. And well, let's click this directions here, uh, biking directions. So I'll click the biking directions, it's 122k ish, and it's around six hours average. I'll do probably faster than that. And the reason I have it on biking is because I'm doing the Grand Fondue race, which is uh, this is the Grand Fondue website, just an annual bike race from downtown Vancouver to Whistler. And it's coming up pretty soon, I think around 10 days ish. Uh, and it's uh, September 7th, and I've been training for the past couple months to do this uh, random uh, race and it's I thought it was pretty cool to show this video uh, to show the, the route in 3D so basically just start clicking this and there you go when you click it this is pretty amazing gets to a 3D visual animation and follows exactly where the route is and this is really good for well if you just want to see how the the route is to see it visually helps you memorize how the turns are going to be instead of just reading directions like on the left here but then on the left one you, you could also read and, and if it, it grays or highlights wherever you currently are so it's in step five right here then it'll go to step six when it's in step six and this is good for bikers because you could see uh, a hill whenever you're going to do a, a route or a bike route and you could basically see there's going to be a lot of hills or not so you could at least prepare yourself or decide it's too much but in this case it's not too bad it's a lot of up and down and we're going to be going along the shore soon so i'm going to keep recording this uh, video for the whole whole um bike race this is for people that have uh haven't done the grand fondue if it's their first time they want to see exactly how it is and it's pretty amazing this just looks amazing google is just doing amazing stuff so and also you can also uh click one of these uh guys right here so if you click it it shows on the top screen where it is so while you're seeing the route you can see where it is and but I uh, see the, the the screen stops here that thing keeps going so you just click it we'll go back to where it is and go here because it's uh, Google just started having this so they still have some issues here so if you just close this and now again it stops again so you just click it here so every time you touch the screen it just stops so you just don't touch the screen so now I will keep recording and basically, like I said, this isn't too bad of a, of a race because it's a lot of, well, up and down, and it's a lot of, uh, it's going along the shore. So you're not going up any of these mountains or anything, so you're not uh, really uh, pushing yourself too hard, but it's still a far, far race. And, yeah, so basically, um, I also calculate how fast this little thing is going. I think it's, uh, well, it takes around four minutes to get, to 124k so if you calculate that I think it's around 1600 uh, kilometers an hour close to speed of sound I'm not I'm just thinking on top of my head I think it's somewhere around that correct me if I'm wrong so it's uh, it's moving pretty fast but then again you think about it speed of sound isn't that fast and if it still takes if you can see it kind of visually going through it like this but this is pretty pretty damn fast and uh, yeah, and uh, the reason I'm doing this bike race, well, me and my couple friends, we just randomly decided to buy expensive bikes and start biking. So we've been uh, training for a couple months, and we thought might as well do the Grand Fondue, and because it basically forces us to train, actually, because otherwise we'll just get killed in this race. And we're doing it clean, so no steroids or uh, blood doping like, like Lance Armstrong. And yeah, as you can see, we're almost done this race. This is the last stretch. And there, and yeah, and there it is. There's the Whistler right here. Well, that's all for today. I just wanted to show this amazing uh, feature with Google Maps and also the Grand Fondue route in vision, basically in 3D visually. To see it. Well, that's all for today, and hopefully you enjoyed this. And stay tuned for another math easy solution.